West Virginia grown. It's like, like you know, it's awesome. Nice. Uh, yeah. right. Now it's when it gets serious. <laughs> This will be a fun one. Motor, big flywheel, belt, pulley. You're back out of the way, but you hit your foot treadle, then you'll start, you'll just start pulling the vine across it, and then you can twist it, and it just, I mean, it just goes freaking down. Huh, so, and it doesn't break the buds no. apart? No. Huh. Okay. That's the cool part about these fingers. It literally, I mean, it's just like, it just jacks his hands them off, you know. Uh, pretty slick. Interesting. All right. First thing, grab your sides. Yep. Lay your tube for two or three long ways. And this is going to be a little tricky to do. Thank you. Appreciate that. Line the top of it up with the top of this beam right here. And there might be a screw in the corner that we might have to move. My son did not... Uh, Pay attention when I told him. <laughs> so. There should be a. There's an extra. Should be an extra twenty. Well, yeah, that's a twenty and a twenty-five. Yeah, the top, the top of them, they don't have to be perfect, close, would be. Now let me. Next step is putting the bearings, getting the bearings on, getting the shaft centered, get everything ready to roll. Goggles. Man, oh man, oh man. There we go. All right. You have to like oil anything to maintain it? You'll have to, once you get it together, you'll see there's grease fittings on the side. Mm -hmm. Once the blue moon, give them a little snort. Okay. Huh? Grease fittings. Well, up. I do this so I can drill the holes in this for the bearings. Okay. And then I'll pull the shaft back out of it and we'll slide the picker bar in. <laughs> this is the part where you use cuss words because these things <laughs> are freaking tight. I wish I had him take about another 4,000 so it would be so much easier. Ours was oh, okay. milled down a little bit. I was going to say it's a little bit, we're tightening it down. Just the keys when I have to line up. Oh, okay. That, gotcha. There's another square stock that goes cool. in. Oh, oh, yeah. Nice. You ready? Yep. Piece of 3 16 key stock, shaft spline, uh, just hub spline. Yeah, just because we just Put looked up, like, what's the easiest for beginning growers? And we just... Yep, drop the ground. Yeah. Um, 
Yeah. Yes. Well, the important thing is uh, on this, uh, you have to give yourself a little extra clearance here. That's why it took me so long. I'm trying yeah. to set my clearance on it yeah. where I have a little more yeah. room on this side because I have bolts so that kind like, of touch and I don't want to hit. And then sky. Bolts here, bolts on the other side. Oh, yeah. right. I think I got lined up. I kept sliding this over okay, is he, uh, until I get myself, you know, I put the key in, you know, I got the bar, I got this set to the shaft, then I give myself enough room, I'll pull it over to where I have some gap because you have bowl on bowl sitting on top of each other, so I'm trying to keep them off themselves, keep your gap a little tight on this side if you want. Um, and once you get that set, then lock your... And I forgot to tell you guys, give yourself at least three inches on your pulley side. Because that way I can get the pulley on it. What does the key do? Well, the key do? Way, I don't give really a shit. That is the key for oh, so that's why we had the shaft that to your hub. Okay. Okay. And then tighten her down. It just keeps if you need, I can set it, it for you here. Oh, okay. You just need one. Okay. You, you have to have room on this side yeah. to get your hand in there to tighten the bolts up. Okay. Um, okay. I'll get you an hour wrench in a minute. We'll tighten these down okay. to lock this to the shaft yep. and then tighten the sides up. You're rocking. I love it. Which I still might have to, <clears throat> excuse me, bump it in here just in a little bit. Because when I put the guard on it, when I built the guard, because I had it set, it's like you have like a half inch clearance between this and the guard itself. I'd appreciate it. Okay, I'd love it a lot. All right, great. You just well, those will. I'll have them off there just in a minute. Actually, I have. I have L brackets. I just set that on there to mock it up. Oh, okay. But it, it sets on there. There you go. Okay. Keeps fingers and toes out of it. Yeah. I'm sitting almost. Is the, is the pulley almost at the end of the shaft on that one? Um, let's go. Well, I've got this one wrong. Yeah, way back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's like a half an inch, quarter of an inch. All right. Yeah, on that one, there's a little bit less than that. I don't All know right. if that's So, let me see a better picture. Let me look. Yep. Yeah, I'd like to look oh, at that. I read yep. that in your book. I took a picture of it. Watch Daisy Lou. Oh, yeah. Because I was remembering yeah. that ours would be clean, whereas mm. most commercial yep. you pull your, You pull your vine in. You pull your vine through this way. Or the ones that come off. Vine comes through this way. You feed it this way. And then your, your shaft rotates that way. And it, it's throwing all your product off the back. The cool part about these fingers is really nothing on them that will mm. catch it, and it spins fast enough that it's it's kind of mm -hmm. levitating it anyway. Uh, you gotta have a raised bed for dinner. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Like, mm -hmm. 